So this is what I'm talking about. Replace the stupid dual parallel smooth rods on the x-axis with one linear profile rail and one recirculating ball bearing car that rides on there and mounted vertical like this with my extruder mounted vertical on the car motor sticking out this way it actually leaves room for me to add one more extruder exactly like this mirrored the other way with the motor sticking out the other side for dual extruders with the nozzles as close together as they could possibly get and butter smooth sliding action hook it up on the Mendel Max Z or X axis in place of the dual smooth rods and bushings and use the same belt drive but drastically simplify the X ends so that all they have to do is hold on to this one piece of profile rail which is got this nice shape with these grooves and the ball bearing cars that ride on there very smoothly I might add and then here is my however you pronounce it in Nibia stepper gearhead stepper with 200 OZ in torque my uh, newly designed stepper or I mean extruder body with a uh, MakerBot MK7 gear and a skate bearing idler that gets pressed up against there holding a J head with this new mount to go on the vertical X axis and be able to mount another extruder facing mirrored like this one and slide butter smooth back and forth this little assembly here will be getting installed on my black Mendel backs tomorrow along with the CCM belt driven rail for the Y axes and we'll have the first prototype of a Mendel Max Pro what you think about that